after 50 cents x. Daphne Joy was listed in a lawsuit against Sean, Diddy, Combs. The In Da Club rapper reportedly requested exclusive custody of their kid. Joy's lawsuit was mentioned in March 2024. Amid a slew of sexual assault claims and a sex trafficking inquiry against Diddy. One month ago, music producer Lil Rod sued Diddy for sexual harassment and misconduct. According to various sources, he stated in his court file that Diddy bragged about using sex workers and identified Joy in the document. In reaction to Lil Rod's complaint, Diddy's lawyer informed us weekly in a statement. Lil Rod is nothing more than a phony who filed a $30 million lawsuit, brazenly seeking an unfair reward. His wild name dropping about incidents that are complete fabrication and did not occur is nothing more than a blatant attempt to generate attention. The lawyer went on to say that they have overwhelming, indisputable proof that Lil Rod's claims are complete lies, and that they would address these outlandish allegations in court and take all appropriate action against those who make them. Nonetheless, the site said that 50 Cent sought exclusive custody of their kid. Sire, how long were 50 Cent and Daphne Joy together? The rapper and the model dated from 2011 to 2012. How many children do 50 Cent and Daphne Joe have? The former couple had a son, sire, together. He was supposedly born in 2012 as Curtis James Jackson. What does Daphne Joy do at work? Joy has experience as a model, actor, and businesswoman. She has previously acted in the films Frankenhood and Venice Heat, as well as Pirates of the Caribbean. On Stranger Tides, she also created Daphne Joy Collection a fashion website dedicated to designing pieces with a women's curves and comfort in mind. Striking, minimally bold, classic silhouettes will always be the intention behind every piece, the website's description states. I hope you feel every bit of beautiful as you wrap yourself in our signature buttery, soft, stretch fabric. Is Daphne Joy a sex worker? In Lil Rod's complaint against Diddy, Court documents labeled her as a sex worker who received a monthly stipend from the last night. Singer. Diddy disputed all allegations against him. While Joy passionately refuted the accusation in her own statement, the claim that I am a sex worker is 10% false in character assassination, Joy commented. On Instagram, I am retaining an attorney to explore all legal remedies against both Rodney and his attorney. If you or someone you know has experienced sexual abuse, contact the National Sexual Assault Hotline at 1-800-656-HOPE-4673. A professional staff member will offer private, judgment-free assistance as well as local resources to help with healing, recovery, and other needs.